Greetings and welcome. Today, we embark on a journey to navigate the intricate world of internal transfers. We at M Yoga Coaching and Consulting are your trusted guides. We'll equip you with the knowledge, strategies and confidence to master this art. Whether you're seeking growth, a change of pace or simply a new challenge, internal transfers offer a gateway to unexplored potential. Think of us as your seasoned Sherpas, leading you through the peaks and valleys of your career. But like any worthwhile expedition, preparation is key. History whispers tales of individuals who dared to shift their course, forever altering the trajectory of their lives. Consider Michelangelo, initially commissioned as a sculptor, yet forever immortalised for his breathtaking frescoes in the Sistine Chapel. And what of Winston Churchill, a man who traversed political landscapes with the same tenacity he navigated his own career? These figures understood the power of seizing opportunity, leveraging their skills in new arenas, and embracing the internal transfer as a catalyst for growth and fulfilment. Now, you might ask, why move internally? Why not seek greener pastures elsewhere? The answer lies in the strategic advantage. Internal transfers allow you to leverage existing relationships, institutional knowledge and a proven track record. Imagine for a moment a skilled weaver in ancient Persia. This weaver, renowned for their intricate designs, desires to learn the art of dyeing. Would they abandon their loom, their established trade, and venture into a completely new profession? A wiser choice might be to seek an internal transfer within the guild, learning from master dyers while retaining their expertise as a weaver. It's about maximizing your existing assets while acquiring new ones, building upon your foundation rather than starting anew. Within the realm of internal transfers, this strategic advantage can be your greatest ally. We stand now at a crossroads. The path ahead, though promising, requires careful navigation. We must understand the terrain, anticipate the challenges, and equip ourselves with the tools for success. In the sections to come, we'll delve into the practicalities of this journey. We'll explore the valid reasons for requesting an internal transfer, drawing upon timeless principles of ambition, growth, and self-actualization. We'll unveil the secrets to convincing your superiors, transforming potential resistance into unwavering support, and we'll equip you to ace that crucial interview with HR, transforming nervous anticipation into confident articulation. Ready yourselves for a journey of self-discovery, strategic maneuvering, and ultimately career advancement. The call of ambition, recognizing valid reasons for transfer. Our ah, ambition, that fiery spark that ignites our souls and propels us towards greatness. Consider the story of Catherine the Great. Born a princess of a minor German state, she ascended to the throne of Russia and transformed herself into one of the most powerful rulers in history. Was she content with a life of mere privilege? No, ambition coursed through her veins. She yearned for power, for influence, for the chance to leave her mark on the world. Now, I'm not suggesting you overthrow your superiors, but Catherine's story teaches us a valuable lesson. Ambition, when channeled effectively, can be a powerful catalyst for change. It's about recognizing your own potential, your desire for greater responsibility, and your yearning to contribute at a higher level. Beyond the horizon, seeking new challenges and growth. The human spirit, much like a ship at sea, craves exploration, new horizons, the thrill of uncharted waters. Stagnation, my friends, is the antithesis of growth. Think of Galileo Galilei, a man who dared to challenge the very foundations of the universe. He didn't just gaze at the stars, he built telescopes, meticulously observing, recording, and ultimately revolutionizing our understanding of the cosmos. 
Similarly, your career journey should be marked by a continuous quest for growth. If your current role no longer offers the challenges that stimulate your intellect, it might be time to chart a new course within your organisation. The alignment factor, matching skills with organisational needs. Now, ambition and a thirst for growth are all well and good, but a successful internal transfer requires more than just personal aspirations. It demands a keen understanding of your organisation's needs, a strategic alignment of your skills with its goals. Consider the story of Florence Nightingale, a woman who transformed the field of nursing. Driven by a deep sense of compassion, she identified a critical need during the Crimean War. The appalling conditions in military hospitals. Similarly, when considering an internal transfer, ask yourself, what skills do I possess that are in high demand? Where can I make the most significant contribution? The art of diplomacy, approaching your supervisor. The decision to pursue an internal transfer, my friends, is not one to be taken lightly. It requires careful consideration, strategic planning, and perhaps most importantly, a delicate touch. Imagine for a moment the intricate dance of diplomacy during the Congress of Vienna. Here, diplomats from across Europe convene to redraw the map after the Napoleonic Wars. Similarly, approaching your supervisor about an internal transfer requires a diplomatic finesse worthy of a seasoned ambassador. Remember, you're not just stating a desire. You're initiating a conversation that could impact your career trajectory and your relationship with your current team. Building your case. Crafting a compelling transfer request. In the grand tapestry of history, words have toppled empires, ignited revolutions and shaped destinies. The pen, as they say, is mightier than the sword. Consider Abraham Lincoln's Gettysburg Address. In a mere 272 words, he redefined the meaning of the Civil War, rallying a nation to embrace the principles of liberty and equality. Lincoln's words resonated because they were clear, concise and emotionally evocative. Your transfer request requires the same level of careful crafting. It's an opportunity to articulate your aspirations, demonstrate your value, and present a compelling case for your transfer. Timing is everything. Choosing the right moment. Timing, my friends, is everything. A military commander wouldn't launch an attack without considering the terrain, the weather, the enemy's movements. Think of Julius Caesar crossing the Rubicon, a decision that plunged Rome into civil war. Caesar didn't act impulsively. He chose his moment carefully, assessing the political climate and seizing the opportune time to make his move. Similarly, the timing of your internal transfer request can be just as crucial as the request itself. It's about reading the organisational landscape, understanding the dynamics at play, and choosing the moment that maximises your chances of success. Now, my friends, we delve into the subtle art of persuasion. For even the most valid reasons for an internal transfer can be met with resistance. Think of Queen Elizabeth I, presiding over her court with a keen intellect and an even keener understanding of human nature. She didn't rule by decree alone, she charmed, she cajoled, she persuaded, masterfully navigating the treacherous waters of courtly politics. Similarly, your approach to securing approval for your internal transfer requires more than just stating your case. It demands a nuanced understanding of your audience and the art of presenting your aspirations in a way that resonates with their own goals. In the vast marketplace of talent, my friends, modesty is a poor sales tactic. You've worked hard, honed your skills, and contributed significantly to your organization. Now's the time to remind your superiors of your worth, to showcase your achievements in a light that illuminates your value. 
Consider the magnificent pyramids of Giza, enduring testaments to the ingenuity and skill of ancient Egyptian architects and engineers. Similarly, your track record within the organization is your pyramid, your testament to your abilities. Quantify your accomplishments, highlight your contributions, and present a compelling case for why your skills are an asset worthy of investment in a new role. Now, even the most brilliant proposals can encounter resistance. It's human nature, you see, to cling to the familiar, to view change with a degree of skepticism. Think of Charles Darwin and his theory of evolution. A radical concept in its time, it challenged deeply held beliefs and sparked heated debates. Darwin didn't shy away from the controversy. He addressed it head on, presenting meticulous evidence and patiently explaining his findings. Similarly, your desire for an internal transfer might raise concerns about disruption or the loss of a valuable team member in your current role. Acknowledge these concerns, address them thoughtfully, and present solutions that demonstrate your commitment to a smooth transition. The language of success. Framing your transfer as a win-win. Negotiation, my friends, is not a battle to be won, but a bridge to be built. Consider the signing of the Magna Carta, a landmark agreement that limited the power of the English monarchy and laid the groundwork for constitutional law. The Magna Carta reminds us that even in the midst of seemingly opposing interests, there often lies common ground. Frame your internal transfer not as a departure, but as a strategic realignment, a move that benefits both you and the organization. Highlight how your skills in a new role will contribute to the company's success, how your growth will ultimately translate into greater value for the team. Building bridges, not burning them, maintaining positive relationships. The corporate world, my friends, can be a fickle mistress. Alliances shift, departments merge, and career paths often take unexpected turns. Think of Eleanor Roosevelt, a woman who transcended her role as First Lady to become a global advocate for human rights. Her influence stemmed not just from her position, but from her genuine compassion and her ability to connect with people from all walks of life. As you navigate the delicate process of an internal transfer, remember that your reputation within the organization is paramount. Maintain open communication, express gratitude for the opportunities you've been given, and leave your current role on a positive note. Patience is a virtue. Navigating the waiting game now, the wheels of bureaucracy, much like the mills of the gods, grind slowly. Once you've submitted your transfer request, there's often a waiting period. Think of Michelangelo patiently chipping away at a block of marble, slowly revealing the masterpiece within. The Sistine Chapel ceiling wasn't painted overnight. It required years of meticulous effort. So too, my friends, does navigating the internal transfer process require patience. Use this time wisely. Continue to excel in your current role, expand your skill set, and network within the department you aspire to join. The HR interview, my friends, is often viewed with a mix of anticipation and trepidation. Think of young Arthur, faced with the legendary sword in the stone. Arthur didn't rely on luck or bravado. He approached the task with humility, determination, and a belief in his own inherent capabilities. Similarly, the HR interview is not a game of chance. It's an opportunity to demonstrate your preparedness, your professionalism, and your genuine enthusiasm for the new role. Approach this interview armed with knowledge, self-awareness, and a compelling narrative that showcases your suitability as the ideal candidate. The ancient Greek aphorism, Know Thyself, inscribed on the Temple of Apollo at Delphi, holds profound wisdom for us today, particularly in the context of the HR interview. 
Imagine Socrates engaging his students in lively dialogues, challenging their assumptions and guiding them on a journey of self-discovery. He believed that true knowledge begins with understanding ourselves, our strengths, our weaknesses, our values and our aspirations. The HR interview in many ways is a Socratic dialogue, an opportunity for you to articulate your self-knowledge in a way that resonates with the requirements of the role. Before stepping into that interview room, Take the time to reflect upon your career journey. Identify your core skills, your areas of expertise, and the experiences that have shaped you into the professional you are today. Your resume, my friends, is but a snapshot, a brief glimpse into your professional journey. The HR interview is your chance to elaborate, to add colour and context, to transform those bullet points into a compelling narrative that showcases your unique value proposition. Think of Marco Polo returning from his legendary travels to the Far East, captivating the Venetian court with tales of exotic lands, bustling markets and wondrous inventions. He didn't merely present a list of destinations, he wove stories that transported his audience, igniting their imaginations and leaving them awestruck. Similarly, you must go beyond simply reciting your resume. Use concrete examples, quantifiable achievements and anecdotes that illustrate your skills in action. Demonstrate how your past experiences, even those seemingly unrelated to the desired role, have equipped you with the adaptability, problem-solving abilities and leadership qualities that make you an asset to any team. The art of storytelling, connecting your narrative to the role. Storytelling, my friends, is more than just entertainment. It's a powerful tool for connection, persuasion and influence. From the campfires of our ancestors to the boardrooms of today, Stories have a unique ability to captivate our attention, evoke emotions, and make information memorable. Consider the parables of Jesus, simple yet profound stories that conveyed complex spiritual truths in ways that resonated with people from all walks of life. He understood the power of metaphor, of relatable characters, and of narratives that touched upon universal human experiences. Similarly, in the HR interview, your ability to weave your experiences into a compelling narrative can be the key to making a lasting impression. Don't just answer questions. Tell stories that illustrate your skills, your values and your alignment with the company culture. Connect your past successes to the challenges of the role, demonstrating how your unique perspective and experience can contribute to the team's goals. Anticipating the unexpected, handling difficult questions. Now, the HR interview, much like life itself, is full of surprises. You can prepare for the expected, rehearse your answers and anticipate the standard questions. But it's the unexpected, the curveballs thrown your way, that truly test your mettle. Think of Nelson Mandela, enduring decades of imprisonment, facing unimaginable hardships, yet emerging from his ordeal with a spirit of forgiveness and reconciliation. He didn't crumble in the face of adversity. He drew strength from his convictions, his unwavering belief in a better future, and his ability to navigate complex situations with grace and resilience. Similarly, the HR interview might present you with challenging questions, probing your weaknesses, testing your composure, or requiring you to think on your feet. Prepare for these moments by reflecting on your career journey, identifying areas where you face difficulties, and crafting narratives that demonstrate your growth, your problem-solving abilities, and your ability to learn from setbacks. Leaving a lasting impression, concluding with confidence. As the HR interview draws to a close, my friends, it's your final opportunity to solidify the impression you've made, to reiterate your enthusiasm, and to leave the interviewers with a sense of confidence in your abilities. Think of Neil Armstrong taking those first steps on the moon, uttering the now iconic words, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. 
It wasn't just a statement, it was a culmination of years of training, of meticulous planning, and of an unwavering belief in the mission's success. Similarly, your concluding remarks at the end of the HR interview should be concise, impactful, and leave a lasting impression. Reiterate your key strengths, your alignment with the role, and your enthusiasm for contributing to the team's success. Express your gratitude for the opportunity and reiterate your interest in the position. The grace of resilience, embracing setbacks with dignity. Life, much like the unpredictable sea, doesn't always offer smooth sailing. Sometimes, despite our best efforts, the winds of fate blow us off course. A denied transfer request is not a defeat. It's merely a detour on your career journey. It's an opportunity for reflection and reaffirming your commitment, even if the path takes an unexpected turn. The path less traveled. Exploring alternative avenues for growth. Now, just as a river finds its way around obstacles, carving new paths through the landscape, so too must you be adaptable, my friends, in your pursuit of career growth. A denied transfer request is not a dead end, it's merely a signpost, directing you to explore alternative routes. Think of Leonardo da Vinci, a man of boundless curiosity and a master of multiple disciplines. He wasn't just a painter, he was a sculptor, an architect, an engineer, an inventor and a scientist. His insatiable thirst for knowledge led him down countless avenues of exploration, each one enriching his understanding of the world and contributing to his legacy as a true Renaissance man. Similarly, within your organization, numerous paths can lead to growth and fulfillment. Consider seeking out mentorship opportunities, enrolling in professional development courses, or volunteering for projects outside your immediate scope of work. These experiences, though seemingly unrelated to your initial transfer request, can broaden your skill set, expose you to new areas of the organisation, and ultimately make you a more well-rounded and valuable asset. The power of feedback. Seeking constructive criticism for improvement. Feedback is our most valuable tool it's the mirror that reflects our blind spots. Seek constructive criticism to understand and grow. Surround yourself with trusted voices for honest feedback. Approach your supervisor with an open mind. Use feedback to identify areas for improvement. The long game. Maintaining a positive outlook and continued engagement. The corporate world is much like a game of chess. It requires patience, strategic thinking and resilience. A denied transfer request is not a checkmate, it's a temporary setback. Maintain a positive outlook, excel in your role and seek opportunities. Network, stay updated and develop your skills. A denied transfer is a turning point, not the end. Embrace growth, stay positive and make strategic moves. The gatekeepers of opportunity. Understanding HR's perspective. Ah, human resources often perceived as the gatekeepers of opportunity, but within those walls lies a perspective worth understanding. Imagine the ancient library of Alexandria, a repository of knowledge. The librarians facilitated access and connected individuals with information. Similarly, HR professionals optimize human capital within an organization. They match talent with opportunity and foster a thriving work environment. Understanding this perspective is key to navigating internal transfers. The pillars of approval. Key requirements for transfer. Just as a Roman arch relies on its keystone, HR's approval of an internal transfer rests on key elements. These are the pillars of your case, the non-negotiables. First, qualification. Your skills must align with the role. Next, performance. A strong track record is crucial. Timing and justification. Your reasons must be legitimate. Finally, transition. Ensure a smooth handover of responsibilities.
learning from organizational research. Let's delve into empirical evidence. Case studies illuminate the path to successful internal transfers. A 2018 study found a strong correlation between internal transfers and career satisfaction, skill development and organizational commitment. Employees who engaged in internal transfers reported higher job satisfaction and were more likely to be promoted. A 2020 study found lateral moves boost employee engagement, innovation and career fulfillment. Your ally in advancement, partnering with MJoga Coaching and Consulting. As we conclude our exploration of internal transfers, my friends, I want to emphasize that you don't have to navigate this journey alone. We at MJoga Coaching and Consulting are your steadfast allies in the pursuit of career excellence. Just as a seasoned navigator guides a ship through treacherous waters, we'll provide you with the tools, strategies and support you need to chart a course towards your professional aspirations. Our team of experienced career coach and consultant, with their deep understanding of organisational dynamics and their proven track record of success, will work closely with you to identify your strengths, values and career goals. Craft a compelling transfer request that highlights your unique value proposition. Prepare for the HR interview with confidence and poise. Develop a strategic plan for your continued growth and development. And navigate setbacks with resilience and grace. Don't leave your career to chance, my friends. Partner with Njoga. Coaching and consulting and unlock your full potential. Book a complimentary career breakthrough call today and let us help you embark on the next chapter of your professional journey. The tapestry of success, weaving together the threads of your journey. We arrive at the culmination of our journey, exploring career shifts and drawing wisdom from history, crafting compelling transfer requests, navigating diplomacy and acing HR interviews, embracing resilience and exploring growth after setbacks. Think of this journey as weaving a magnificent tapestry, your tapestry of success, each step, each challenge, each skill. These are the threads creating your masterpiece. The Power of Partnership, your journey to career excellence with Mchoga. Now you might be thinking, this all sounds well and good, but can I truly master this art alone? And my answer to you, my friends, is a resounding, yes, but why would you want to? Just as a lone explorer benefits from the guidance of a seasoned Sherpa, so too can you benefit from the expertise and support of Mjoga Coaching and Consulting. We've scaled the treacherous peaks of the corporate world, navigated the winding paths of career advancement, and emerged with a deep understanding of the terrain. Our team of experienced career coach and consultant, with their diverse backgrounds and proven track records, are here to guide you every step of the way. We'll help you identify your strengths, clarify your goals, and develop a strategic plan tailored to your unique aspirations. Think of us as your trusted advisors, your confidants, your champions in the pursuit of career excellence. We'll provide you with the tools, resources, and unwavering support you need to navigate the complexities of internal transfers, overcome challenges, and ultimately achieve your full potential. A call to action, seize the reins of your career destiny. The time for contemplation, my friends, is drawing to a close. The knowledge you've gained, the insights you've gleaned, these are but seeds of potential unless planted in the fertile ground of action. The future, as they say, belongs to those who dare to seize it. Think of Rosa Parks, a woman whose simple act of defiance, refusing to give up her seat on a segregated bus, ignited a movement and changed the course of history. She didn't wait for permission, she didn't seek approval, she simply acted on her convictions, knowing that even the smallest spark can ignite a firestorm of change. Similarly, your career destiny is not something to be passively observed. It's a force to be shaped by your choices, your actions, and your unwavering belief in your own potential. So I urge you, my friends, take that first step. Reach out to Mjoga Coaching and Consulting, Book your complimentary career breakthrough call and let us help you unlock the doors to a brighter, more fulfilling career.
a final word embracing the transformative power of change. As we conclude our journey together, my friends, I want to leave you with a final thought, a guiding principle to carry with you as you navigate the ever-evolving landscape of your career. The only constant is change. These words, attributed to the Greek philosopher Heraclitus, remind us that life, much like the flowing river, is in a perpetual state of flux. To resist change is to stagnate, to deny ourselves the opportunity for growth, for renewal, for the unfolding of our true potential. Embrace change, my friends. Seek it out, even when it feels daunting, even when it challenges your comfort zone. For it's in those moments of transition, of stepping outside the familiar, that we often discover hidden strengths, uncover new passions, and ultimately create a life of greater purpose and fulfillment. And remember, you don't have to face these challenges alone. M Yoga Coaching and Consulting is here to guide you, to support you, and to empower you to create a career that truly reflects your talents, your values, and your aspirations.